everyone. It is Sunday, June 28th. Yes, 28th. It's still relatively early, which is a good thing. And I think this is probably the most presentable I have looked in the last few days, even though my hair is not blow dried. I don't know if I am. I'll probably just let it air dry, but I'm wearing makeup, even though I know it's going to totally melt off. I just, makeup makes me feel good. And I've gone so many days because of this heat without wearing it. So today I am. Yes, yes, yes. I didn't do anything for my lips yet, but that's okay. Excuse the very loud TV in the background. Jasper and the boy are watching the TV for now. But as you can see in this title, I will be going grocery shopping. So that is the surprise haul that's coming today. But there's also going to be a surprise mini haul and I'm not putting it in the title and I'm not telling you what it is. So you'll have to keep watching to find out. But yeah, we're gonna get going and head out to the stores soon and get this day started so we can come back and hide inside with air conditioning. <laughs> yeah. Odin, did you get a new toy? Press the, press the button! Are you happy? <laughs> hey guys, so here is an overview of my Walmart grocery haul. And I'll show you what all we got. Um, I love cottage cheese, so and usually with fruit, so this is already remixed, and I haven't tried them before, but they look like they'll be really yummy and a healthy snack. A uh, bag of dried beans. We cook with beans quite regularly, so it's good to have a bag. Um, mustard and must bleh, bad backwards. Mustard and mayo for Jasper's sandwiches. And for produce, we got cauliflower. I'm gonna make mosh, mashed cauliflower with steaks. Cilantro. I'm making taco salad. Avocado for that. Green onion for that. Um, I'm making like a sweet potato quinoa feta like bowl type thing. Broccoli, I'm making beef and broccoli. Peppers go in all the Mexican things. And then I love these no sugar added jello mousse. As you guys know, I'm not eating refined sugars, so those are a nice thing for me when I'm craving something sweet, as well as these no sugar added peanut butter cookies. Yum, yum, yum. Um, for Odin, we picked him up one of these little like graduates dinners. He doesn't have these a lot, we just got one, um, but lately he hasn't been eating much because a combination of teething, being sick, and a growth spurt, so we wanted to get some, like, he loves them, so I know he'll eat that, and right now it's just kind of a desperation of getting him to eat. Same with these pouch things, he loves sliced cheeses for sandwiches, etc. This, we got steak, pre-cooked steak and um, chicken, because right now turning the oven on is a nightmare. And um, I technically didn't have to get cooked beef because um, I could have cooked it on the stove, but this will go in the beef and broccoli and this will go in um, wraps and salads. Steaks to go with the mashed cauliflower, Jasper's additional lunch meats for the week, cheeses for our Mexican dishes, and just extra cheese for anything random. I got one of these like, um, what's it called, like skillet meals. That'll be for like Jasper really isn't the biggest cook, so on Thursdays when I'm gone, he'll probably make that. I also got two body soaps because I seem to be going through body soap really fast, having um, multiple showers in the summertime. So I got two scents, one for the morning and one for the evening. And this part is a, well this might be hard with one. These are like three quarter length, like kind of workout pants. I got the exact same pants in gray about three weeks ago in an extra large and these are a medium. So that goes to show my weight loss progress. I'm currently down 16 pounds. So, and when you're five feet tall, that means two pant sizes, I guess. I got a pair of pajamas. They have these cute like yellow bottoms and these pineapple tops, so cute. And they were like 12, $12. These were $18. And then we got Odin these really cute Batman like pajamas. So cute with little like sh black shorts. Best part yet, it has a freaking cape on the back. Like 
How adorable is this? <laughs> I can't wait to put that on him later. Anyways, yeah, that was the Walmart haul. All of that with clothing, body washes, and all those groceries was $150. That's pretty awesome. And my surprise haul will be coming very soon. Hey guys, so I wanted to show you the secret haul. It's so mini, but anyways, it's a little bit of a surprise that I didn't know I was going to do, and then I ended up, and I'm like so sleepy right now, I was like kind of like falling asleep on the couch, and I'm like, I better show them before the lighting is completely gone, because I kind of wanted to film it like this. Let me reach. Oh, what do you think? Little blue bag. Ta-da! David Steen. So uh, I got an email from them a while ago that they came out with some new flavors, some new summer flavors. They like already did redo the menu for summertime, but these were additional, just a, a new feature that came out and they're called Old Tiny Treats. So you get, um, this pack is like a sampler package and inside looks like this. So you get all the new flavors that they have right now, which are banana split, black cherry, cotton candy, mango fruit punch, and Sim Shirley Temple Organic. And then you get these um, three Brock sugar thingies. I don't know if I'll eat those because I don't. I'm not having sugar right now. But they are flavored. The pink one is cherry. The blue one is cotton candy, and the green one is watermelon. So I saw the email that these flavors had come out and was like, oh my gosh, I have to have those. Right now my teas, I have a lot of like green iced teas and a lot of black teas and just like really like caffeinated teas, which is great for the morning time. But midday, like I, you guys know, I'm like drinking tea constantly, right? So midday, I don't really want those kind of teas anymore and definitely not in the evening. So I wanted some more like fruity herbal kind of things. And I saw that these came out and was like, God, that's gotta happen, right? So, um, and then while I was there, I got the tea of the day for a dollar in my travel mug, and it was black cherry, which is in this kit. So I got to try it, and it's really good. Like, it was like a black tea. So your first, like, hit when you would take, like, a sip would taste like black tea, but then as you'd swallow, you get this, like, burst of, like, that flavor that's in black cherry cola. So amazing, like I love David's tea. I don't know how they come up with these amazing teas, but they do and it's amazing and I just love them, love them, love them, love them. Um, I have an entire David's tea haul video. It's like one of my earliest um, vlog episodes and it's not my proudest, like my I messed up the editing on that video, but it's my most popular video out of all of them. So I'm not gonna link it below because I'm not proud of the editing on it. If you are really determined, you'll go look for it and you will watch it, but yeah, anyways, so I'll let you guys know how these teas are as I go through the days trying them, but yeah, I didn't want to tell you guys right away that I was getting this haul as well, but yeah, big shopping day today between Walmart and that big mall day, so we'll be taking it easy for a while. Um, I do need to get a little bit more wedding decorations, but we have a lot of other like big stuff coming up in the next couple weeks. We're getting our passports, we're booking Thailand, we have to pay for our wedding license and pay our commissioner. So it's like, it's wedding time right now, so I'm really focusing on wedding stuff. So there won't probably be many hauls coming up other than that. But I will be filming my next video on my June favorites. So keep an eye out for that probably this next like few days before June ends. Anyways, we're going to probably have some dinner. I'm making vegetarian lasagna and Caesar salad. Mm -mm -mm. And then we're going to go for a walk because I think Jasper really wants to buy another fan. Multiple fans. That'll be like the fourth fan in the house. Surviving the heat wave. Even though today's not even that bad. It's like... 27 degrees, but it's all overcast. But you know how it goes. <laughs> yeah. This yeah. is the first time Odin's done a piggy, uh, piggyback and held on for himself, but he's holding on to Jasper's cheeks like so tightly. <laughs> we made it to the park and I'm back to sporting one of my funky hairdos. But, anyways, we made it here and we have it all to ourselves and it's raining. 
when's the last time I said it was raining? I think it was like a week and a half ago or so. Anyways, yeah, I'm super happy that it's raining. It's just a little drizzled and it's still really, really hot out. But that's okay because it means it's helping with some of the forest fires and the grass. That's like, I mean, you can see the grass is, yeah, it needs rain. <laughs> that's your Batman face. Hey guys, we just got back from the park a little bit ago and had a shower. I'm in my new pineapple pajamas. I'll try and catch a shot of Odin in his Batman suit. Or I already did, so it's cute when he's running around. It kind of like flops in the wind. And I, oh, he's banging. I got myself my David's cotton candy flavor tea. Really excited about this one. It's really good. It's kind of like a little bit too sweet for me. I probably wouldn't buy it again, but it's a nice little treat for now. So yeah, thanks for watching today's vlog. Please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe for daily videos. I make videos every single day. There's the little Batman. <laughs> Where's your little cape? You're gonna show your cape flapping in the wind? <laughs> Anyways, I'll see you guys tomorrow.